Hello, good morning or good evening to everyone. Welcome to Mainframe t Tutorials. This is COBOL Tutorials of 12th part. So this is the continuation to my previous video. So here in this video, I would like to share uh, something about the difference between string and unstring uh, and search and search all. So this might be useful for the beginners, learners, or it might be also sometimes useful for uh, in when you are attending for an interviews. So let's see the difference between string and unstring. So string is used to merge multiple variables into single variables and unstring it is used to split the single variables into multiple variables. So if I t uh, tell about the example of this using string, so you have a name, sub uh, surname and a middle name as a three different fields and in this if you want to merge this as a single name, so you can merge those individual different fields to a single fields. In the same way for unstring, so you have a variable called a timestamp. So in timestamps you will have date, time and everything. So you want to split these into multiple variables then you can go and use for unstring. So it is terminated with nstring and it is terminated with n unstring. In the multiple sending fields, in this multiple sending fields and one receiving fields are here are used yes only one sending field and multiple receiving fields are used we can also use with pointer option is used to specify the starting position of receiving field whereas here with pointer option is used to specify starting position of sending field so important note here is uh, no dot are allowed that is no period are allowed between string and unstring so in the same way periods are no periods are allowed between unstring and and unstring so this is the difference between, these are the main dif major difference between string and unstring. So let's see the difference between search and search all. So when you say search, it is a linear search. When you say search all, it is a binary search. What's exactly the difference here is, here the data needs to be in a sorted order. Uh, sorry, here the data need not be in a sorted order. Here the data should be in a sorted order. Either it should be in ascending or in descending order. That is in search all. So coming to search, search can be applied for one dimensional array, two dimensional array or multi-dimensional array. Whereas for search all, it is strictly for one dimensional array. So here the access is a little bit slow uh, compared to search all. Search all is faster than uh, search. Why? Because the data is already sorted in order and uh, either that is either in ascending or deserve that makes the search faster. And it is mainly only used for one dimensional. Here we can use one dimensional, two dimensional, multi dimensional. Here we can use multiple when conditions that is in search, whereas in search all you can use only one when condition. The set verb is used to increment or decrement the next value. No set verb is required in search all. So we can use any relational operators in search. Only equal to operator is used in search all. So these are the difference between the search and search all. Uh, so this might be very, very uh, useful for the beginners, especially when they are learning, when they are new to this uh, COBOL programming. And it is also very helpful uh, when you attend for interview or and uh, for better programming. So it is good to have these differences and uh, get started in uh, working on this. Thank you so much for uh, watching this video. I hope you got, you had got, got a good information on this. Have a great and pleasurable day.